So here we go. Main event time. AJ Styles has his chance to become the WWE Champion and AJ Styles goes it alone. He represents the OC, but no Carl Anderson and no Luke Gallows. Maybe because of the fact that they had to deal with Ricochet earlier tonight, or maybe the fact that AJ Styles does indeed want to do this for himself. I'm not entirely sure, but I'm all for a fair contest if Styles can indeed prove that he can have one. We've seen him do it in the past, but his attitude since WrestleMania has been far from graceful. AJ Styles has had a real chip on his shoulder and he's been cheating his way to win and you would have to say that he's cheated his way all the way up to Backlash. He is indeed number one on our Raw ranking system but just looking at that wouldn't tell you the entire story but Styles stands here tonight as the number one contender and if he is up for a fair fight he is still seriously a threat to the King of Strong Styles undefeated record. As the lights go down, here comes the ace of Monday Night Raw, the number one draft pick from general manager Eric Bischoff, the undefeated King of Strong Style, the WWE Champion Shinsuke Nakamura and Nakamura who won the WWE Championship at WrestleMania doing what nobody else could toppling the beast and he did it in Brock Lesnar's home state of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Shinsuke Nakamura walked into Suplex City and he walked out as a champion and now in his first championship defense, Nakamura faces the phenomenal AJ Styles. And we must remember too, that Nakamura faced the Universal Champion on the day of the draft. And Nakamura defeated Rey Mysterio. So Nakamura, well he has gone from strength to strength. And this undefeated record that Nakamura has goes on way beyond the Raw ranking system. It's been a long time since Nakamura has suffered a defeat. Could it all come to an end here at Backlash? Big fight feel for our main event as AJ Styles takes a look at the WWE Championship. That is what it's all about and that's what it's come down to here at Backlash. Referee signals for the bell, our main event is underway and Styles and Nakamura lock up for the first time and it's Nakamura who forces back Styles into the corner. Will we get a clean break from the King of Strong Style? Oh look at this, the mind games continue from Nakamura and he says come on, come on AJ, let's go. Nakamura Definitely got in the mind of Styles when Styles took on Ricochet a few weeks back. Came out, took out both Gallows and Anderson, two King Shasses. And when Styles was paying attention to what Nakamura was doing, he was rolled up by Ricochet. Just a little bit more fuel added to this championship match. And they tie up for the third time. Styles floats around to the back and keeps hold of Nakamura, picks up and takes down Nakamura, headlock applied. And Nakamura, the champion, has to find a way out. He does so, gets to his feet, and now they're both up and oh, Styles. Oh, Styles went for the back fist and Nakamura got out the way, said, so come on and kick Styles in the chest. AJ Styles replies with one of his own. Kick to the leg. Knee to the face. You can hear the boos. 
They've been getting louder and louder in recent weeks when AJ Styles has been participating, not a fan favourite anymore. Now part of the club, the OC. And cranking the arm, the arm lock applied. This one's starting off with a cagey affair. And Styles having to relinquish the hold from a shot from Nakamura to the gut. And now Nakamura drags Styles to the corner. Kick from Nakamura. Those educated kicks. And that is something that Nakamura has in his locker. And AJ Styles is fully aware of it. It's just whether or not he can defend against it. Nakamura in control. You saw some vintage Nakamura there. And now picks up AJ Styles. Tries to tie up again. And these two lock up and lock horns. And this time it's Styles that comes out. This time he does hit the back fist. Reply with a chop from Nakamura and a kick. And now sends AJ Styles, the challenger, off the ropes. Ducks underneath. Shinsuke Nakamura floats over the top. Oh, went for the knee. Styles caught in clothesline from the challenger. And a kick to the back by AJ Styles. These two know each other very well. And that's Styles' turn to take Nakamura to the corner. And Styles. Well, table turn quick. Table turned again. AJ heads up. And begins to unload on Nakamura. Punch after punch. Nakamura forces away. AJ Styles. Styles comes forward. Walks straight in. Gets caught. I think Nakamura is looking for a German suplex, but AJ Styles. Switched out of it. And Styles up and a brain buster. Nicely done from AJ. And AJ goes for a pin. Took his time. One. And just a one count. Styles is going to have to be a bit quicker than that. If he's going to put away Nakamura. Snap DDT. That's much better from the challenger. And Styles hits the ropes. Drives the knee. Oh. Nakamura got out the way. Smartly done. And Nakamura with a knee. And there was nothing that Styles could do about that. Oh, and a running basement style. I would say Kinshasa. Oh, but, you know, running knee lower. Doesn't get the impact that the normal Kinshasa would. Full impact when Nakamura comes running in with that knee. Will Nakamura hit that tonight? Will that be? A crowning victory for Nakamura if he does indeed deliver the King Shasa. Well, Styles won't want to know. He'll be looking to avoid it at all costs. And that Tornado DDT served him well. Now the arm lock. Styles has tried all. Oh, wrenched the arm. Tried to keep Nakamura ground-based for the most part of this matchup. Forearm from AJ. Second one. Went for the back fist. Not doing very well with that back fist. He's gone for that twice now. Nakamura has seen it. And that kick cleaned the clock of AJ. And this time the German suplex comes off from Nakamura. And Nakamura on the move. Heads to the second rope. A little bit of showing off to the crowd. And comes down with the knee. Right between the eyes of AJ. In one, two, and Styles kicks out at two. Nakamura had a cracking contest with gentleman Jack Gallagher on Raw Dark. If you didn't check that out, I suggest you go and watch the Raw Dark playlist. It was a great matchup and just goes to show that, that Shinsuke Nakamura is happy to mix it up with anybody. And fair play to Gentleman Jack. He did put on a really great contest. You don't want to miss out on those dark matches. It's not like a live show. They're matches that simply don't make the main show. But are just as good. And Styles on the outside. And the forearm comes crashing down. And he nailed Shinsuke Nakamura. Referee up to the count of two. And Styles using the outside to his advantage. Head first into the steps 
goes Nakamura, referee up to the count of four. The title cannot change hands via a count out. Styles knows that. Up to six. Styles continues on the outside. Seven now. And we're up to eight and Styles. Well now he brings Nakamura in. Nine that would have been and uh, Styles. Maybe judged it perfectly. Oh, AJ. Oh, reversal from Nakamura. Sends Styles off the ropes. Oh, and the running knee. Knee again and takes the wind and the breath right out of Styles. And then a kick, a drop kick. And oh, Styles. Didn't look too good after that. AJ in a spot of bother. Who wouldn't be against an undefeated WWE champion? And a big knee and Styles on that rope and Styles looks out of it at the moment. I would say that Nakamura now heading up to the top. Up on the shoulders, high risk. And turns! AJ Styles inside out, even causing a daze for himself. And Nakamura now with the Dragon Sleeper. Submission applied to AJ Styles. Referee asking the question in our main event for the WWE Championship. Will Styles tap out or can he find a way to escape? Styles manages to find a way, forced and rolled forward, Nakamura, Nakamura comes forward, AJ Styles rolls through, oh and has he got it, yes he has, the calf crusher, well that came out of nothing, Styles has turned this one, and Nakamura now being asked the question, are you going to tap, or are you going to find an escape, what is Nakamura going to do, Styles look at this, really wrenching the ankle back, but oh, Nakamura with a stiff shot to the back of the neck and a kick. And that breaks the offense for a moment from AJ. Knee to the face by Nakamura, but Nakamura moving a little more gingerly after that calf crusher. May need to protect the ankle for a little bit while it recovers and Styles is willing to exchange. And a Pele! Got him. Got him good. And takes up and a 1916 where we saw two of them it took and plenty more to put away John Moxley. But that has set up Nakamura in perfect position for the 450 that Styles didn't get and DDT from Nakamura. Well he put him in the perfect place. But Nakamura was wise to it and now Nakamura Kino! No Kinshasa, instead a phenomenal blitz from AJ Styles. Great matchup. Tense matchup. It's on a knife edge this one. And Styles. Oh, driving the knee into the chest of the champion. Great to see no Gallows, no Anderson. Just these two going at it, 450, this time Styles gets it and got it all and this time Styles is, oh, two count, he's close. This is the AJ Styles that I wanted to see, the one that will stand and fight and put it all on the line and Nakamura could be out and Nakamura kicks out very late. A lay two from the WWE Champion. Styles is gradually chipping away at the arsenal. And the defense is beginning to break down of Nakamura. And where's AJ going now? Referee starts to count again. And Nakamura on the outside after being dumped out there by AJ. And AJ perched on the ring apron. What's he looking for here? Oh! A moonsault! Do you have any, any idea what it takes to get the leverage off of the apron to hit a move like that? That was impressive. And Styles keeping up the work and Nakamura tries to fight back and Nakamura does come back and Nakamura
Try Styles down on the concrete floor. What a contest we're seeing in our main event and Styles now picked up by Nakamura who drives AJ Styles, the challenger, back first into the hardest part of the ring, the ring apron. Well, we say that, but earlier tonight we saw even more the hardest part of the ring, which is the wooden exposure underneath it. And Finn Balor took on John Moxley. Oh, up goes Styles. And Ayushi Goroshi. From Shinsuke Nakamura, we're used to seeing that from Styles, but... Oh, and a kick. Nakamura sending Styles off the ropes. Went, I think he went for the leg and Styles caught the arm, stopped him. Another fight, the offense, elbow to the back of the arm. And oh, this time he got him. And on the back of the head is Nakamura. He's dumped right down. Oh, and now Styles, I said, we're so used to seeing it from AJ. And AJ gave us his version. What is Styles thinking? Drags Nakamura. We've seen Styles with the 450. Oh, is he looking for the forearm? He delivered it on the outside of the ring. Can he catch him now? Nakamura slow to get to his feet. He's now up. Here comes Styles. Styles, he got him. And he could be the new WWE champion. Here we go. One, two. Oh, Nakamura. Just got that shoulder up and Styles in anguish. Looks at our efficiencies. Just two. He was. And now the chin lock trying to wear down Shinsuke Nakamura. He's got Nakamura against the ropes. But we've seen time and time again how Nakamura can bounce back from adversity. I thought at many occasions against Brock Lesnar, it was over for Nakamura. But somehow, someway, Nakamura found a way to the championship. Now he has to defend it. Picks up AJ Styles. Gave AJ a moment, then a knee. Oh, went for the shot. AJ got out the way. Styles, Hele, that's the second one. Can't take too many of them. And Styles takes up Nakamura. And you can see AJ holds his ribs. Those kicks to the gut have taken their toll, but Styles is still on top. Second rope, AJ forearm. One, two, he goal. That was close. Whew, that was close. AJ Styles was within a second of becoming the WWE Champion. Nakamura's shoulder lifted off the mat in the split second before our official could bring that hand down for the three. This matchup continues and Styles has obviously got frustrated and decided to head to the outside to try and dish out more punishment. And instead, Nakamura has found a second wind. Oh, shot. These two just exchanging now. Referee up to four. Styles, oh, back first. Well, we saw Finn Balor with a drop kick, I believe. And Nakamura Kinshasa. Oh, he got him. Blink and you will miss it. But this could be all. Styles rolled into the ring. One, two. Oh, and Styles finds a way. Maybe the time that it took for Nakamura to get Styles into the ring and then execute the pin was enough. But Nakamura is waiting. Boot to the midsection. Oh, he went for the Kinshasa again and Styles with a drop toe hold. AJ Styles calling him up. Oh, we're... Here we go! 
styles clash and with that one two four how and AJ Styles asked the same question he too says how well Styles wants him up Styles wants Nakamura up again is he looking where is he going oh look at this a reverse DDT the champion's days are numbered the undefeated reign is on the verge of being toppled it's all AJ is he gonna go again for a second stars clash it looks like it takes up Nakamura oh Nakamura Nakamura breaks free Nakamura found a way and oh AJ Styles Exploder from Nakamura Can he do it? Styles getting to his feet Kinshasa One Two Three AJ Styles is defeated by Shinsuke Nakamura and Nakamura retains the WWE Championship but it was a close contest here you see Nakamura with the Kinshasa to the outside but AJ kicked out Styles Clash and at this point I thought we were going to crown a new WWE Champion but Nakamura fought on like a champion does the Exploder and then of course the King Shasa. That was all she wrote. One, two, three. And Shinsuke Nakamura has been in a battle, but he retains the WWE Championship here at Backlash. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us. Good night.